Do you really think that? But, but you are convinced that this is, you know, Ishmael, that's it. He is the father of the Arab. <laughs> what I can do to you? <laughs> Have fun. <coughs> All right. Uh, I have a question. Do you call the crime of the Jews and Romans against the innocent Jesus on the cross as act of terror, terrorism, or love? Okay. Let us see this guy. Suppose he's a Muslim. <laughs> I don't want to answer now. Okay, you don't have the courage to answer. Look what this Muslim he said to me. I have a question. Do you call the crime of the Jews and the Romans against innocent Jesus on the cross as an act of terror, terrorism, or love? Just to show you, here we go, he's calling back. Hello? <clears throat> Why you hang up? I hope he's not playing games. If you don't answer, I'm going to block you. Okay, take care. Anyway, so he's saying, he's trying, you see, this is what they try to do. They try to ignite hate and division between us and the Jews. Have a question. Do you call the crime of the Jews and the Roman against the innocent Jesus on the cross as an act of terrorism? All right. Hello? Hello, Hello. Uh, mute you too, please. Hello. Yes, I hear you. Mute you too. Go ahead. I just, I just asked you a question. I hope that you can answer me. Yeah, you are a Muslim. What is? Right? It? it doesn't matter what am I. No. Why it doesn't matter? Why it doesn't matter? Why it doesn't matter? I'm just asking you a question. I know, you and I'm asking you a question. To are, you a question? are you a Muslim? Do you consider your act? name is Ali you Eddin, so obviously you are a Muslim. My friend, why you, do, why you don't want to say I'm a Muslim? Are you, are you ashamed to say I'm a Muslim? Listen, listen to me. I'm, I'm a Muslim, Muslim and I'm a proud Muslim. Okay, thank you. So let me no, ask you. Have a let me answer you. Let me answer you. Let me answer you. I'm you just said, okay, you just, you just said, you just, you just said, let me answer you. You said about the crime of the Jews. Can I say my question, Okay, go ahead. If you don't mind. Go ahead. Okay. I have, a, <clears throat> excuse me, I have a logical, rational question for you. It has nothing to do with religion. You just gave me a question. Do you consider the crime? Right? Hmm. I'm asking the question now. Right. Just give me one minute. Sure. Do you consider the ugly crime hmm. of the Jew and Romans against the innocent Jesus on the cross in a barbaric way as an act of terrorism or as an act of love? Hmm. Should I answer you now? Yes. Please. Okay. Please do. Is it you Muslims claim that Jesus himself was a Jew? With all due respect, I'm asking you a question. Never answer the question. I'm answering you. I'm answering answer you. my question. I'm please. answering you. Aren't you no, Muslims? No, no, no. You claim. I'm trying to ask. Aren't question. you Muslims? You claim that. Let, to, let me answer you. Question. Hold on. Let me answer you, man. Okay. okay. Just relax. Relax. Okay. You are, I'm asking. Just relax. We are having a conversation. Why you don't want to have a conversation? So the second oh, man, I say I something, you shout and you scream, you don't want to talk. So how do you say the Jews, they made a crime about Jesus against Jesus, if Jesus is from the Jews, according to you? How do you say the Jews did a crime against Jesus, if all the apostles of Jesus are Jews? So you are saying the Jews did a crime against the Jews. So why you are saying, you are, why you are using the word Jews then? Why you don't say that the one who killed Jesus, they made a crime against Jesus? No, you are labeling them as Jews, but you forgot that you must then believe that Jesus himself was a Jew, and the disciple of Jesus were Jew, and Mary was Jew, and all of them, they are Jews. So why you are saying the Jews? Because you hate the Jews. Sure. Secondly, yes, isn't, it the Quran, isn't it the Quran says that they did not kill Jesus? So how are you <laughs> saying to me that the Jews, they killed the innocent Jesus when the Quran say no, they did not? 
are you accusing Allah to be a liar? Because you just admitted, so you just admitted so that the crime against Jesus, as you call it, crime, happened. So you just convinced me now that Muhammad was fabricating a story by saying Jesus was not crucified. So can I talk now? Sure. <clears throat> okay, sure. Okay, I just waited for you to finish. So please don't interrupt me. Mm. I never interrupted you. So let me speak. Right. Now, I'm asking you once again, mm. according to your faith as a Christian, mm. it doesn't matter whoever did this to Jesus. It doesn't matter to me. Now, I'm asking no, you in general. Because you made the name. What? You say the Jews. Let me, Is it I, the Jews? I first of all, well, first, first, finish, of all first of I all, all cut you, so don't okay. cut you me, see, I'm not okay? cutting you. You, you, say, you. you say that it doesn't matter. It matters. So otherwise, if it doesn't matter, why you say Jews? If it does not matter, why you said to me, do you condemn the Jews? No, I didn't say condemn. So what do you say? What you say? You said the Jews. You said the, you said the one who killed Jesus is the Jews, correct? Never mind. That no, not, not, not never mind. Not, 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 not never mind. You want me to I can show you a question. Here we go. Your question is in your text in front of me. I will show it. In the yeah, screen, yeah, yeah, it's okay. So, so I you accuse the Jews, okay? So, now the why you said the Jews killed Jesus if the if Jesus is one of the Jews and the disciple of Jesus from the Jews, too? So, what was your problem? Why you think so the Jews are bad? Can I speak with Why you think the Jews are bad if Jesus and them and 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 the disciple, according to Islam, they are Jews anyway? Go ahead. Now you will let me speak without no interruption, please. Yeah, but don't I did not me, interrupt don't you. So me, it doesn't speak. matter. It doesn't matter don't if I say the Jews or not. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I just I, I interrupt you because you're no, trying no, to no, come no, out no. as something Jew you say. Romans killed him according to the Bible because he made himself equal to God, and you know that better than me. All right. Okay. Okay. Roman Jew asked for his death. Okay. So Romans okay. are the one who. Made okay. it. Now my question is very clear for you. Please right. answer my question. Mm -hmm. Whoever right. killed Jesus it doesn't matter to me according to your faith. Now I'm asking you. Mm -hmm. According to you, according to you as a human being, mm. whoever did this barbaric act against the innocent Jesus on the cross, do you consider such act as an act of terror or act of love? The crime being done according to your faith against the innocent Jesus. Okay. Do you call this as an act of terror mm. from those criminals against Jesus or act of love? Mm. As simple as this. Well, Just obviously, me, terror or love. obviously it's it. an act of love and I will tell you why. Because Jesus said, nobody can take my life from me. I put it down from my, by myself. Secondly, he said, Father, forgive them. They do not know what they are doing. Which means Jesus, he said clearly that those who did, they've been fooled by the rabbi. The rabbi is the one who wanted the death of Jesus and they wanted that to happen for he is a threat for them. So Jesus, he forgave the crowd, forgive everybody. He said, Father, forgive them. And this is here showing us that the Messiah is the Lord of mercy. He told us to love our enemy. Not only that, even those who killed Jesus are forgiven by Jesus. But because you are a person who is full of hate and anger, you are trying to make us Christians hate the Jews. So now you came back and says, do you know that the Jews killed Jesus? Shouldn't you condemn the Jews? Isn't it the Jews who commit a crime against Jesus? All of this because you want us to say, oh, we should hate the Jews. They are our No, they are not our enemy. And let me tell you the bad news for you. If not the Jews, I will not know about Christ. So the Jews you are condemning, they are the one who brought Jesus to us. All the disciples of Jesus, they were Jews. All of them. So we are Christians today, thankful to the Jews. It is the Jews who brought Jesus to us. It is the Jews, even they taught you as a Muslim about Jesus. Your prophet, he never met Jesus. He never saw Jesus. He met the Jews. So you Muslims, because you try to ignite hate against the Jews, for you have a madness. You do your best. And look at the hypocrisy of the Muhammadan. In the Quran, okay, say, hold on. The hypocrisy of the Muhammadan. No, you can't speak until I finish. The hypocrisy of the Muhammadan like you. The Muhammadan like you. You claim that Jesus was not killed just because you want me to believe and to hate the Jews. Suddenly, Jesus was killed. So why you are saying Jesus was killed if Jesus was not killed? Go ahead. So I was listening to you for four minutes. Can you give me enough time to answer you? Go ahead. Okay, mm. number one, mm. if you consider the ugly barbaric crime against this innocent Jesus on the cross mm. with those two criminals beside him on the left and right side mm. as an act of love, I would love you as a Christian to define for me hate. 
what is hate for you? Hate if is such you. act. Hate is you. Let me you finish. Hate. Okay, let, let me, me finish, you. please. Hate, hate. Let me finish, please. Hate. Hate. Okay, okay, okay. Let okay. me finish, please. Okay, no, no, let me. You ask me a question. You ask me a question. You ask me a question. Do you want to define define hate? Don't you want to define hate? Let me. Let me make my. You can just give me a question. Let me let me answer you, my friend. Let me answer you. Can I answer you? No, 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 I'm not yet finished. Okay, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, finish, okay, go, go ahead, go ahead. Let me finish. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Very simple question. If you consider such act, hmm. ugly act, hmm. as an act of love, hmm. so therefore, I consider, according to your logic, you should consider any terror act like this as an act of love. You are trying to tell me that terror or torturing a person, innocent person, hmm. can produce love. So this is love for you. Now, therefore, I ask you define hate. Number two, when you say that we hate Jew, with all the respect, it's obvious to me that you are not reading the Bible. It's not me who says in John 8, 44, mm. you are of your father, the devil. Mm. The lust of your father, ye will do. Mm. He was a murderer from the beginning. Mm. And upon that in the truth, okay. because there is no truth in him mm. when he speaks a lie. He is a liar and he is father of lie. Hmm. That's what your Bible says about the Jew. No, it's not this me. is not about the Jew. So therefore, you, okay, you are a liar yes, again. The, now, the please liar, answer my question. Okay, I'm answering you. Okay, hate, let me answer. You. Such let, let me answer. Let me answer you. As long as you say oh. that, first of all, you said that crucifixion is a torture. Do you agree? You want me to speak? Do you agree? No, you say yes or no. You don't need to make oh. the 10 sentences. Do you agree that torture is what a crime? If, what if I have in the is, cross that is, 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 is a torture? Is, is a crucifixion. That's a barbaric act. Is a, is a, is a, okay, so you agree that crucifixion is a barbaric act. Do you agree? Uh, Mr. Christian Prince. Are you going to answer, answer my question? I'm answering you. I, I'm having a conversation Define with you, my friend. Is no, you, you said you said that the crucifixion is an act question. of terror, barbaric Please act. You said question. my friend, why you don't want to answer? What's wrong? Why have a conversation? Do you agree what you just said? That crucifixion is an Please act of torture, is a barbaric? Please. Do you agree? Please finish. Please define it. If crucifixion, okay, shall okay, you uh, we are, love, we are talking, we are talking. It. Hold on, let us one by one. You said two things to me, so we will take them one by one. The it's first one, I said, listen to yourself. You see, you, you don't want me don't to talk, right? You said, you said that the crucifixion. Let me show you why you are, be, you are why language. you are being a coward. You will not if let I, me talk. Are you trying to force me to I hang up on you? Is that what you want? I want think. Okay, so is I'm asking you, I'm asking you, I'm asking you, is, is a crucifixion, you said, you said the crucifixion, you said the crucifixion is an act of barbaric savage terror, do you agree with that, you said that, you agree, that crucifixion is an act of barbaric savage, do you agree? I'm still looking for you to define hate. Please. I am. I am. You see here because you are stuck. You are afraid because the Quran teach crucifixion. You are the one who said, and everybody heard you saying that this is a barbaric act to torture somebody. Shut up! You said that. Everybody heard you. You are the one who said, "Shut up! Let me talk. Let me talk. Let me talk. You coward. Let me talk. You, coward. you are a coward. You, don't, you will. I'm answering you. I will hang up on you and I will call you back. Everybody heard you saying. That this is the torture is a barbaric action, the crucifixion. But your God, look what He did. Not only crucifixion, He ordered Muslims to cut hands, crucify people, cut their feet from different opposite direction, and even your prophet, he put nails in the eyes of people in the cross. Read with me. This is your prophet, not me. And this is your book. You're a prophet, he put nails. On the eyes of people who he crucified them. He cut their hands and he cut their feet. Do you see it? Shame on you. So you are saying this is barbaric when this is the religion of Islam teaching. And the Jews, they are not one who crucified Jesus. It was the Roman. So your God adopted the torture of the Roman and he liked it. And your prophet, he practiced it. And not only that, he add to it, putting nails in the eyes because he loved torture. And you are the one who said, do you agree with the torture and barbaric, bra, 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 bra? Look like you did not know your book. Secondly, as long as you are talking about hate, isn't it your book who says that Allah is the one who put hate in the heart of the Jews? 
why you are playing the Jews for what Allah he planted in their heart Allah he said in many places and let me show you first as long as you said define hate chapter 5 verse number 14 and from those who call themselves Christians we took their covenant but they have abandoned a good part of the message that was sent to them so we planted amongst them hatred and enmity till the day of resurrection and look at this hypocrite Muslim calling us crying about hate can you define hate for us please please hold on I want to I want to put my lips a stick because I want you to tell me the hate what hate what do you think about the Jews did to Je suddenly he's crying about Jesus now and he want to define hate this is hate it's in the front of you it is the planted seeds of the devil which is called Allah so why you are crying for what your God he planted because you are hypocrite and ignorant and idiot so when I showed you that the verse saying that Allah crucified you don't want me to talk suddenly you said can you define hate can you define hate can you define hate you don't want me to talk about the savage barbaric crucifixion anymore because I just got you busted from the Quran same time if Jesus in the cross says forgive them father who is better than Jesus who he you said he is an innocent and you just said and everybody heard you he claimed to be God guys did he say this Muslim that Jesus he claimed to be God so Muhammad is a big fat liar they did not kill him because he's a messenger they killed him because he said he is God I will call you back and I want you to answer give you a chance to answer what do you think about the torture and the savage barbaric teaching of Allah in the Quran of torturing killing cutting hands chopping foot and even cutting fingers and putting nails in the eyes of people and you are the one who said to us what do you say about the savage barbaric torture to Jesus let us see if you will answer <laughs> I don't think he would answer. What happened, potato? Okay, so he will not answer. So, guys, this guy he got so excited, he got ready, he wants us to say something against the Jews. But look, who is Paul? He's a Jew. Who is Mark? Who is John? Who is all of them? Who is Mary? Who is Moses? Aren't they the Jews? Yes, Abdul. So what do you say about what I said? Here we go. I will give you time to answer. First of all, no, no. First of all why you have hang up on me? Because you will not let question. me answer you. You, you, will, not me, you will not let me you will not let me talk. No, 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 no. You will not let me talk. Me. You cannot talk in the same you show that no no CB, you open your YouTube channel and you challenge Muslims and I called you up as a Muslim. Mm -hmm. And the best you can do is hung up on me because is this people, the way that you people are my witness no, 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 no. you are a crazy you person you will not let me talk and the because, look now look now you are doing no. it again i call i am what the is, one who called you back i said is, i will hang up you i no, said no. i will hang up on you so i can answer and i will call you back and i did correct oh no cb cb have the guts to have you don't have the guts yourself i don't know don't doubt no, isn't, no, isn't it you let me repeat the, the question for you and you see everybody is uh, uh, you are showing your 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 real you isn't it you who say that crucifixion yeah. is a barbaric yeah. savage torture did you say that so did you say that did you say yeah. that did you say yeah, that please. listen 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 and learn listen mm. and learn mm. let me educate you all right please okay please don't take that for grant. you can carry that with others not with us okay mm. just listen and learn i'm listening please. okay i asked you a very if you consider such act as love Hmm. father killing his son on the cross in an ugly way hmm. you call this love 
You see, look, look how, like look how hypocrite you are. Look, look how hypocrite. This was not the question. You coward. This is was not the question. Your question was about the Jews killing Jesus, not about the Father killing His Son. You see how coward you are because now you try to change the topic. You change it totally, 180 degree. You did not ask me about the Father. You never mentioned the word Father, and you are a liar. You say the Jews they tortured Jesus in the cross. What do you say about savage, barbaric? Torture. Let me talk. Let okay. me talk. Yes, so, Mr. I'm letting talk. you talk, yeah. brother. Let, let me you talk. So why you are lying saying now about the father when this is was not the, mind, this the, was not the question? The why you are lying? Father, why you are add, why you are course. adding why you are adding things you did not say? Why you are adding stories now? Is that what you said to me? When you call me? It's recorded. Nice. People laughing at you. Yeah. Is that what you said yes. to me when you call me? You said the Jews killed yeah. Jesus. And do you agree with the torture and the savage barbaric crucifixion? Now I'm asking you, do you agree with the Quran taking the Roman uh, torture of yeah. a crucifixion and cutting hands and feet? Is your God yeah. Allah yeah, yeah. is a savage yeah. barbaric yeah. like the Roman? Yeah. Is yeah. your God yeah. Allah yeah. barbaric yeah. like yeah. the Roman? That you keep talking. Yeah, Prince, you talk too much. Let us speak. Nobody well. talk as you want to stop. You, no, no, don't keep why are you are changing the topic. Us, why you are to changing the topic? Us, you know. I want you please to go one by one. Can you answer me? Do you as long you come as long you're, as long you're yeah, going to the ham? Listen, I'm losing my never, Listen, Abdul. Listen to me. Muhammad, listen. Can never listen, you no, said no, 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 my name, you said my your, name your is name is a Muhammad my and a name slave is of Allah. Allah. You are you are no one. You are just a slave of Allah. Listen, 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 listen. Isn't you who said mm -hmm. that you you are against the barbaric torture of a crucifixion? Why you don't say the let same to your God? My statement, yeah, Brent, let okay. me finish. Man, give me three minutes to speak. Okay, okay, wow. I'm giving you three minutes. Go ahead. What do you think about the torture? What do you think about the crucifixion torture of Allah? Can you do that? You challenge me because you will not do you will not you to you give me all these three look, minutes look, without look, no look, interruption. You call me Can back you and you that? start talking about Can the you father. Because you are a liar, you call me back to talk about the father when this is not our topic. Why you are changing the topic? Okay, I'm listening. Listen to Start from the crucifixion torture, please. Stop talking. Please. No, 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 no. It's not about stop talking. I know Muslims, they never answer. Stop uh, from the torture yeah, of the crucifixion. Yeah, friends, I'm yeah, listening. Friends, yeah, friends. Go ahead. Yeah, friends, I knew you for a quite long speak, time. And we spoke speak, in the past. Speak, speak, speak. You know me very, very well. Speak, speak. So please listen. Speak about the torture listen. of the crucifixion, please. Go ahead. Relax, relax. Go ahead. Now, let me educate you. Mm. Let me educate you. Mm. When I said the father, now, it's very clear. We are not talking about the father. Don't change topic. Don't change topic, God's Abdul. Potato, don't change topic. Again, he, you mentioned the crucifixion, the barbaric crucifixion topic. of the Jews. The Stop being That's a why. coward. Stop. Jew, yes. Don't. Same okay. Topic. So I don't talk about. Topic. Don't talk Let about. The, no, 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 no. So what do you think yes, about the savage Let torture of point. the crucifixion of Jesus? What do you think? Go ahead. Let me make my point. I'm coming to your question. Don't worry. Hmm. Just let me make my point. Hmm. Either relax, have a deep breath, get yourself something cold, I'm lemon juice or something, ahead. and listen, please. please Just relax. Please. Okay, please. I'm listening. Please. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Don't interrupt me. Give me three minutes. Okay. Now, when I said Father, whom you call God the Father, hmm. John 3.16, hmm. God so loved the work that he gave. Hmm. So it was the Father hmm. who planned and mastered mind the crucifixion of his son on the cross mm. for your salvation mm. so it was given by the father so it's the father who planned the entire crime from the beginning mm. so when his son came and i said the claim i didn't say jesus is god i said he claimed to be god okay. so there's difference between being and claim mm. he made the claim to be god so the jew and roman especially jew looks into him to kill him for what mm. for claiming to be god Okay. Because they call this in their religion as murtad. Hmm. So they want wanted punish him for that. Hmm. So therefore the father is one who planned the hmm. killing of his son hmm. for your salvation in the name of love. So I'm asking you, if this is love for you, define hate. Okay. Now when you want to define hate, you, you stop giving me, you hang up. You I'm said, the, you said the three minutes, right? You said you want three minutes. Are you done? Okay. 
Okay. I'm not yet. I look, look, guys, look, 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 look at this. Look at this. Coward, cowardice behavior. Look at this cowardice behavior. Not. This is your question in the screen. I'm coward. This is your question in the screen. Shut coward. up. Shut up. You said to me, give me three minutes and you will shut up, right? Shut up. Okay. No, look look, look at your up. question <laughs> in the screen. It's in the screen. People, they see it. You never mentioned the father. You said, <laughs> do. Uh, let, let me read your question. Let me read your question, you coward. Have, have, have a question. The, have a question. Have do you call the crime of the Jews? Uh, shut up! Me. Shut up! Let me let me let me speak. Let me speak. You you you, what, what, you idiot! What's wrong with you? Let me speak. Bye. You said to me what you want to say. I gave you three minutes. Bye, coward. <laughs> Bye. He hang up the potato. Look at the question. This is your question, you potato. But because you could not get the honey you want from the question, so now you switch to speak about the father. Preparing a crime against his son, but is it Jesus said, I put myself down and nobody can take it from me? Isn't it Jesus says to Peter, Put your sword down? He don't want protection of anyone, and you coward, you just said that the Jews they wanted to kill Jesus because he claimed to be God. And that's a very good reason to kill somebody according to the Jews, right? So yes, Jesus, he claimed to be God. And you just admit it. So everything we learn from Muslims about Jesus was a lie. And because he could not make us agree with him in hating the Jews, he changed the topic to talk about the Father. And he did not mention to us why Allah, he planted hate in the heart of the Christians and the Jews. Why you blame the Jews even for that? As long as you are talking about define hate, here we go. What hate? Hate is made by Allah. I'm giving you the definition of hate. Is to hate somebody to the point you said, you know, like you you force hate on him. You know, when Allah He planted among them enmity and hatred. So what is left for the devil? Is that will fix the Christians, will make them better people? Or this is shaitan, Satan? But because you are a coward, uh, you said what you said and you run. Coward. Every act of hate, according to Islam, is coming from Allah. Even your sex in Islam is coming from Allah. Even adultery is a decree from Allah. And if the Jews, they try to kill Jesus, the Quran says, Allah made it, planted for it. And let me show you from the Quran. The Quran is full of verses about destiny. Everything in this earth is a destiny from Allah. When somebody tried to kill somebody, when somebody hurt somebody, when a man he raped a woman, when a man he commit adultery, everything is from Allah. Because you Muslims believe in destiny, preset crimes made by Allah. And the verse, chapter 64, verse number 11 in front of you. Not only that, even the sin of Adam was destiny by Allah. All sin in the world. When Moses debating Adam about committing sin, saying to him, because of you, because of you, we are out of heaven. Adam, he said to Moses, you idiot, do you blame me? for an act Allah he decreed for me that I should do 40 years before my creation Allah what decreed for me all sin satanic sin is from Allah and the proof in the front of your eyes 
are you blaming me for something which Allah decreed for me 40 years before he created me that is hate while the God of the Christians and you quote the verse for us God he loved the world so he sent his only begotten son to save them not to die really but if death will bring salvation why not believing in Jesus including his death will bring salvation and don't worry about Jesus he's alive anyway he overcome death by death so Jesus the one you say God he planned his death the Quran says Allah he planned his killing the hadith says that and hatred is made by Allah the vendor of hate is Allah chapter 5 verse number 14 and torture is beloved act of Allah as you see in the Quran and the coward you you said and everybody heard you and this is recorded will be published all over YouTube and people will die laughing at you you said do you agree with the torture crime barbaric crucifixion so as long you agree that crucifixion is barbaric torture why Allah he accept the Roman torture to be part of his religion and not only it is savage cutting hands adding to the crucifixion and cutting feet and not only that your prophet he did put nails in the eyes of people as we showed you how barbaric how savage how much hate muhammad have in his heart while jesus saying in the cross forgive them father they do not know what they are doing your prophet was heating nails and inserting the nails in the eyes of his enemies while jesus was forgiving his enemies those who scream kill him kill him he says father forgive them they don't know what they are doing i love them all your prophet was making a fire cutting hands and feet crucifying people and putting nails in their eyes and you are talking about savage and barbaric and hatred how much muhammad hatred he have in his heart to do what he did what about cutting a woman to pieces splitting her alive and she is over the age of 80 Muhammad is a very loving person and Muslims are against barbaric behavior You see the hypocrisy and the coward you have to hang up because what he can say The plan of my God my friend is to save us and If the Lord he knew that they will kill him that is additional proof that he is the Lord and if the Lord he is a person who will not run from a death that is additional proof that he is the Lord Aisha the Muslim is a coward he run not only that he asked one of his followers to die in his stead coward Isa coward like you who hang up and run away and as long all the story is a lie anyway what about we blame Allah to send the Isa to the Jews and Allah he made the Jews try to kill Isa so he can punish the Jews what about we ask Allah making Adam commit sin so Adam will get out of heaven and we ask a Muslim before why Allah he did that he says Allah was looking for a victim so he will be known <laughs> and not only that every sin we do including rape and crimes according to Islam is the act of Allah read carefully we are not like Muslims who make speeches and they will not let you talk shouting trying to silence you you cannot do that with me 
Verily Allah has fixed the very portion of adultery which a man shall do. What is that? So if you commit adultery, my friend, it's not your act. It's not your decision. It's Allah. Allah is the one who move your private part. Allah is the one who play with it. Allah is the one who make your eyes go far. Allah make your eyes go in her uh, and your private in her. Uh. It's not you. Not only that, Allah decide how many times you do boom boom. If you don't believe me, it's in front of you. A man he should indulge. I should, he should, he should. It's not like a choice. So the Jews, if they try to kill Jesus, well, Allah, he wrote that for them. Kill Jesus, try to kill Jesus. So why you blame the Jews? <laughs> what a stupid cult. <laughs> and the whole point is to make us believe and to hate the Jews my friend to hate the Jews that's mean we are not Christians no more and that's showing the huge difference between a cult like Islam and a beautiful belief like Christianity you are doing your best to make me hate the Jews and you said the crime of the Jews five minutes after when we got you busted you changed the crime of the Jews to make it the crime of the father because you're a potato. The first one did not work. Let's try the second one. <laughs> you see, I am a Christian because of the Jews. Because if the Jews did not bring the gospel to me, I will not know about Jesus. So thank you, Jews. Thank you for bringing salvation to my life. We love the Jews, my friend. You do your best, live in your hatred. You are an Arab man trying to spread hatred, and I am an Arab man and real one, not like you. You are a potato. I think you are just an you know a person who's been forced to speak Arabic. You do not know your religion. You open an article speaking about the Bible and you quote for me a few verses from there. And this is why you don't want to talk about your religion. And this is why you are being a fool. You say things will condemn your God. Do you see, guys? Do you see, my friends? Do you see, my brothers and sisters, how beautiful Jesus is? This is how we should be. In the cross, he said, forgive them, Father. You see what? If Jesus did not do that in the cross, that means all his teaching about loving your enemy, it was a lie. Correct? Because look, he says to us, love your enemy, forgive them. And then he don't want to love and he don't want to forgive. But look at the amazing Christ. He have nails in his hands, in his feet. He been tortured. He's bleeding. He's dying. And now he is worried about those poor people. And instead of thinking about himself, he is thinking about them. And not only thinking about them, He's thinking about us. Because if Jesus did not say that in the cross, and I'm sure the Lord he knew that he said that for a purpose, many of those who have evil heart, they will wage war against the Jews for they killed our Jesus. But now after Jesus says, forgive them, Father, peace, peace on earth. Nobody will seek revenge. And nobody will kill the Jews, and no Christian should hate the Jews. It's amazing, few short words of the Messiah. Make a better creature of us. Make us a human again. In the same time, the God of Islam, he took the any humane torture of a crucifixion, he adopted, and he add to it Cutting hands and feet and even fingers and putting nails in the eyes. This is why, my friend, I am a Christian and you are a Muhammadan, a slave of Muhammad, 
Aka Allah, the God who planted enmity in the heart of people. And it's very funny, a Muslim saying, Can you define hatred? As if he is a person against hatred. Well, here we go. If I am a Christian and I have hatred inside my heart, Quran says, Allah planted hatred on us. The devil Allah. That's the devil. You know, if somebody, Jesus said, I came for the sick, right? Let us say for the sake of argument, according to Islamic Christians are sick people. They need help. Okay, if they are sick, you make them more sick? Yes. For Allah is evil. If you planted hatred in their heart, what good that will do to mankind? Nothing. Hatred will bring nothing but hatred. Allah proven again to be the devil. While Jesus preaching love and mercy, love your enemy, Allah was planted hatred and he want to divide as a Christian. That's why I warn you always, there's many priests that try to divide us between Catholic, Protestant, Orthodox. Here we go. The plan is in front of you. The plan of the devil to make the Christians churches instead of being one church. There's nothing that's called Catholic, and there's nothing that's called Protestant, and nothing called Orthodox. There's a Christians, and this is the only name was given to us in the Bible. And anyone follow other name than the Messiah is a fool. Any man who follow a bishop, a priest, he is an idiot. There's one name only, and no better name to carry is the Christ. And that's why my name is a Christian prince. I am prince by him. Otherwise, I'm no one. He made me prince. I am a child of God because of him. There's no name better than him. So why in the world do you want to choose a better name? Don't never, never call yourself Protestant. Never call yourself Orthodox. Never call yourself Catholic. You are a Christian, my friend. And follow Jesus, no bishop, no pope, no priest, no man, no Christian prince, no prophet, but Jesus. For all are his servants. So why you follow the servant instead of following the Lord? A bishop who divide us he is not serving the Lord. If you go to Romans second, you will see that speaking about the division. Those who they divide the brothers are, are not the brothers. And all of us, we are one. The Bible says it clearly, there's no Greek, there's no Hebrew, there's no free, there's no slave, there's no male, there's no female. For one, all is one by Christ. And with this, I say, there's no better word to end with than the word of my Lord. Maybe I will make the video shorter and we will end it with the call of this Abdul and we will leave it there so you guys can download it. So the process of uh, uh, cutting the video will take some time, but don't forget to download the video and let everybody laugh at this Muhammadan hypocrisy. Thank you for being here. It's already 4.15 a.m. in the morning for me and I'm speaking here for how many hours? God knows. But the Lord is always giving us happiness to be family together from around the earth. The Lord is beautiful and He brought beauty to our life. While the Muslim trying to make us hate others, the Lord always He brings mercy and love. So I go to sleep now. I have no hate to no one, including this guy. That is how beautiful the Lord is. No hate. Hate will kill the person who carry it never never be a person of hate because hate will kill you first look at them look at them at least look how they live unbelievable you will not believe how crazy it is to be there to be to live there it is the land of hate for they are denying the lord and his love when you deny the lord you forsake the lord the lord will forsake you because you refuse his mercy and his love and he gave you free will you don't want me go let us see how they can survive by their own they have oil they have gas but they have no love 
and their life is misery go to Saudi Arabia go to Kuwait go to Emirates unbelievable crazy go to Asia go to Jordan go to Syria crazy crazy and disgusting for the lost the most important thing a human being he should have love yourself not only as yourself love yourself and love your neighbor this is even in the Old Testament love your neighbor as you love yourself love yourself but don't forget to love others but the Messiah he went farther it been said to you it been said to you but I say and what he said love your enemy how beautiful thank you guys for being here may the Lord bless you and thank you for those who always come here and join us in the chat and download the videos and support us in every way in every mean may the Lord bless you all Christ is Lord Islam is false and see you soon again take care Thank you.